I'll tell you who people are kind of uh, upset with is uh, British Petroleum CEO uh, Tony Hayward. Uh, because uh, uh, over the weekend, he was out on his yacht. Yes. Yeah. And, and when President Obama found out that uh, Tony Hayward was relaxing on his yacht, he was so angry, he missed a putt. <laughs> 54 minutes past the hour. Time now for the most news in the morning with Jeannie. BP CEO did manage to find cleaner waters over the weekend, and many said it was another major PR sale for the company. But many critics are saying that the president can't say anything about it until he puts down the golf clubs. Here's Jeannie. It's the yachting versus golf smackdown. Round one, BP CEO gets pummeled for taking a day off to watch his yacht race. Yeah. How dare he just take off the height of stupidity. How do you spell fool? But before you could spell it BP CEO, President Obama's golfing came under attack. Almost four, five hours on the golf course with Biden. But it shouldn't have been eight times between the spill and now. Actually, seven times. CBS White House correspondent Mark Knoller says already President Obama has played 39 rounds of golf compared to the 24 George Bush played his entire presidency including some that got into a Michael Moore film. To stop these terrorist killers. Thank you. Now watch this drive. And while some equate President Obama's golf to Tony Hayward's yachting, two different men, two different jobs, one management style, the president's defenders note a big difference. That's the thing, he didn't create that mess that is there. Because what they want the man to do, put a wetsuit on and go down and fix the pipe. Meanwhile, Politico pondered the really important question. Why is Tony Hayward's yacht named Bob? Wondering if it had anything to do with the Bill Murray movie, What About Bob? Oh, a sailor so scared he has to be lashed to the mast. Now Tony Hayward is being lashed. I really think it was a disgrace. On the other hand, supposedly it was the first day off he's had in two months. I really don't care. Too bad. Look what he did. Every day of his life is a day off. I think he's probably due for a little downtime. But downtime on the water can be a downer. Remember when presidential candidate John Kerry went windsurfing and it ended up in an attack ad. Whichever way the wind blows. BP CEO is being mocked in an animation by a Taiwanese tabloid website. He sits on the beach sending out a drink to a guy drowning in oil from the mouths of babes. My mom doesn't take breaks like every two months. You don't really need to take a break every two months to go see a yacht race. In the two hours it takes to golf or to go yachting, another one to 10,000 tons of oil could leak out. President Obama, I'm not sure he should actually be golfing right now. Oh, in the hole, in the hole. Just plug the darn hole, Mr. President. Ginny Mo, CNN, New York. <laughs>